What's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. So today I'm making this video for you guys with special permission from management. And what I'm going to do today is show you how the child checkmate key fob works if you have a theft mate equipped child checkmate system. So right now I've just turned the bus off. I'm about to get diesel. Um, I did not put it in charter mode because I want the horn to go off so I can show you how you can silence it with the fob. So this is the double check feature that is active right now. It's going to activate any second. And then I'm going to cancel it. Please sit down. Someone will be here shortly. There it goes. So just a quick press of the button will cancel theft mate and double check for 10 minutes. And sometimes you get a double beep when you do that. You don't get it all the time though, especially if the dome lights are like already on or something. So let's see if we get that now. So there's the double beep. The dome lights light up. That means theft mate has been canceled. On older units, it will say theft mate has been canceled you know, with the female voice, but since this one has the male voice, it doesn't do that. I'm not really sure why they took that voice out, but that's just the way it is. Um, something to note is that if you cancel theft mate or double check and you've already triggered it, the next time the key is turned on, you will still get that unauthorized entry warning. So just an FYI for you guys. Uh, there is another mode that this fob can activate, and that's theft mate maintenance mode. What you do is you hold this down for five seconds, and then you will get a double beep, but it'll be different than the one you heard earlier. It'll be more like the one when the child checkmate is manually activated. So we hold the key fob for five seconds. Theft mate maintenance mode activated. And we get the voice confirmation that theft mate maintenance mode is now activated. And what this does is it gets rid of the theft mate for eight hours, eight hours maximum, or until you turn the key back on. If you cycle the key on and then off, the system returns to regular double check and theft mate operations. So say for instance, you activated the wrong mode, not a problem. All you gotta do is cycle it on and then off. Warning, check for unauthorized entry. And like I said, using the key fob does not get rid of that unauthorized entry warning. And that's all there is to it. Um, so theft mate maintenance mode is primarily used by technicians, so that way they can perform maintenance on the bus when it's in the workshop, so that way they're not having to go back and hit charter mode, for example. Because theft mate maintenance mode is like charter mode, but it's, it gives you more than two times the length of time because charter mode is three and a half hours and theft mate maintenance mode is eight hours. So I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, leave a like and peace out until next time.